Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'd love for you to hit that subscribe button down below. So today I wanted to share a Petal and Pup try-on haul. They have so many cute fall pieces out right now, so I wanted to share a little fall outfit inspiration with you guys. I had shared a Petal and Pup try-on haul earlier this summer that you guys really enjoyed and I think you will love this one just as much. So I do have a discount code for you guys to use through the end of September as well to get 20% off your entire purchase and everything will be linked right down below for you guys. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so I wanted to start off first with this dress that I have on and my discount code will be listed down below for you guys. It's 20 Rachel. That'll get you 20% off their site through the end of September. And if you have never ordered from Petal and Pup before, they are an Australian based company. So I would just double check the size chart. Make sure you're ordering what size you think will be best for you. I tend to go up just one size in their items and I will have sizing info listed down below for each item that I try on to kind of help give you guys a size reference. And I am 5'7 for height reference too. But this dress is just so darling. It's definitely one of my favorites that I'm going to try on and it's like the perfect dress to transition from summer to fall in. And I love the style of it. It's just nice and lightweight, easy, breezy, relaxed. It kind of reminds me of free people, but let's talk about the color of it. I absolutely adore this burnt orange color for the fall season. I think it's so pretty and I love that it's just like the tiered dress style. I think it's so cute and it has the little ties. You can tie it shut in a bow if you want to. It's also got the tie detail on the sleeves as well. I love it with some gold jewelry and then like a hat or a headband would be a cute accessory too. And this dress is perfect of course right now to wear with sandals or wedges if it's still pretty warm where you live. But then for the fall I love it with some booties or some over the knee boots would be super cute too. So lots of different options. When it starts to get really chilly you could add on like a chunky cream cardigan too would be a really cute addition to this dress. But Definitely one of my favorites and I think you guys would love this dress as much as I do. Next up is this cozy sweater that I love so much. It is super, super soft. I will definitely live in this for the fall season. And it's just like the perfect neutral color. I love it. And I've got it paired with this corduroy skirt. This I got last year, but I'll try to link some other corduroy skirts for you guys. You could also do a cute denim skirt as well. But I love pairing sweaters or chunky knits like this one with a little skirt. I think it just makes for such a cute fall outfit. Something different from jeans. I am not a huge jeans girl. I would always choose a dress or a skirt over having to put on a pair of jeans but sometimes it's just inevitable you can't avoid them all season so this outfit is just totally me this looks like something that I would wear often during the fall and it's super cute paired with some booties or over the knee boots and then I usually always add on a hat my favorite fall accessory this would also be really cute styled with like a plaid blanket scarf if you want to add on even more of a fall feeling to it but I think that this just turned out so cute and it's incredibly cozy too. And I wanted to show you guys too for the days that you do want to wear this sweater with jeans. I love that it is a slightly longer length. I think that's super cute and flattering and it is not itchy at all. It's super soft. Next up is this cute little dress and this is another one that's really great to transition from summer to fall. I love the style of it with the tears and the poofy sleeves. I think it's just so darling and this one is a black and white gingham which is one of my favorite prints for the fall season. It's just very classic. You can't go wrong with it and this dress you can style lots of different ways easily dress it up or down add on different accessories it's also really cute for fall activities like going to the apple orchard or the pumpkin patch just like that other cute orange dress I just shared that one's great for fall activities as well family pictures all sorts of different things and this one also really cute with boots or over the knee boots and then I'm going to try it on next with my hunter boots to show you guys how cute it is like really styled for fall and then I wanted to show you guys what this dress looks like with a hat on and then my red hunter boots. I love this black and white gingham or like the black and white buffalo check print paired with pops of red or hunter boots for the fall season. I feel like this outfit just looks like fall. It would be perfect to throw on for a day at the apple orchard or would also be really cute for fall family pictures. So this is another way that you could style it and depending on what color hunter boots you have, you can't go wrong whether they're just black or hunter green, whatever color you have would honestly be really cute with this black and white gingham and then a little hat. 
And then here is another super cute sweater that you can also pair with a skirt like this. I love the style of this sweater. I think it's so pretty. It's kind of got like the big bell sleeves and the big cuff at the end, which this one reminds me also a lot of a Free People sweater I got last year in like a pumpkin spice color. But I love this cream. It'll be a great neutral to pair with all kinds of different things. It's super soft and cozy, not itchy, and great for the fall. And then also as we head into winter and the holiday season, you'll definitely be able to get a lot of wear out of this sweater and style it with all kinds of different things. It's got the big cozy turtleneck up here that folds over. You can kind of just like bunch it up, add on a necklace if you want to. But again, I love it with this little corduroy skirt and I usually just do a little half tuck in the front so that you can see the button or you could add on a belt if you want to. And you can do this look with any kind of skirt really, whether it's corduroy, a denim skirt, if you've got like a cute plaid skirt for the fall season, or even just like an army green one or a navy or something. I know there's lots of different options. I'll try to link some down below for you guys, but you could style sweaters like this with any skirt that you've got and then add on some booties, over the knee boots, whatever you want to, some hunter boots even too, and then I've still got my hat on and I'll try this sweater on next with some jeans for you guys so that you can see what it looks like with that, but absolutely love this pretty little sweater. And then here's also that sweater paired with some jeans and then I just slipped on my hunter boots which looks really cute with this. And again you can do a little half tuck but I'll also show you guys it does look great just worn down. It's a little bit longer. It's got the little slits on the side and it does almost cover completely in the back. So really great sweater. I think you guys would love it as much as I do. Next up, this might be one of my favorites, and it's this big, cozy teddy coat. These have been popular for the past few seasons, and I'm so glad they still are this fall. They're just the coziest, snuggliest, cutest things, and I love this pretty brown color. It's got the big, cozy pockets on either side, and I've just got it on with this plaid blanket scarf just to add a little bit of a fall touch, and then a hat or a beanie, too. I love pairing teddy coats with a cozy beanie when it starts to get really chilly, and then underneath, I've just got on a basic white tee and just some jeans and my red hunter boots. Again, I feel like this outfit just looks like fall and I cannot wait for it to get cool enough to start wearing this. I also wanted to show you guys what this teddy coat looks like without the scarf. I've still got the hat on. You could also take it off. And then I just swapped out the hunter boots for my brown booties. I think this jacket would also be really pretty with like some cognac brown over the knee boots. So lots of different ways that you can style this, whether you want to add on like the plaid blanket scarf hunter boots to go for like the more cutesy, cozy fall look. Or you could easily dress this up, swap it out with some pretty boots and make it more chic. Still very cozy, but definitely has the ability to be dressed up for like a night out during the fall season. And honestly, I love to even just throw these teddy coats on just like with some black leggings over like my workout or athleisure wear just very casual I get a ton of wear out of these and I think this is just the cutest little coat Next up is this sweater, and I am so obsessed with it. It is seriously the most comfortable thing ever. It's so soft, and I could just definitely live in it. And this one is like a long sleeve t-shirt meets sweater. It's kind of thin like a long sleeve, and it's tight on the arms right there. But it's like a sweater material, and it's super soft. It's got some stretch to it, but... I love the length of it for one, so you can pair this with jeans like I have on now, but it's also the perfect sweater since it is longer to pair with leggings if you want to, like the Spanx faux leather leggings, which I love. I'll link those down below. If you don't have them, they're a must for me for the fall, and those would be really cute paired with this too with like some black booties or over the knee boots, but love the length of it, and it's long all the way around, and I love that it's tight on the sleeves right here. It's looser up at the shoulders, and then it's just nice and relaxed and flat flowy through the body. It's just, like I said, the comfiest thing. You could feel like you're lounging around, but you still look cute and put together for the day. I love this rust color for the fall season. I think it's so gorgeous. And this one comes in a handful of different colors. I really want it in white too. I feel like that would be a really great layering piece. And white is just a great neutral. I love pairing it with cognac brown for the fall season. But yeah, I just cannot say enough good things about this little sweater. You guys have got to get it for yourself. You'll love it as much as I do. Pick your favorite color or get it in a couple colors. This will definitely be on repeat for me for the fall season. And I've just got it on with this little hat, which I just recently got this hat. It's only $25. It's such a steal and it's so cute. I love these wolf fedoras. As you can tell, I literally always wear them. And then I've just got on jeans and my little booties. So lots of different ways 
ways that you can style this. It'll be so incredibly versatile and I will just absolutely wear the heck out of this for the fall season. And then I wanted to show you what this sweater looks like with a plaid blanket scarf added on just to add a touch of fall to it. Again, this sweater will be so incredibly versatile. You can style it about a hundred different ways for the season and you'll be so comfortable, but still cute and put together. This is just so, so soft. And I've had this plaid blanket scarf for a few seasons now. It's seriously always my go-to. I just love something about the color combination and I actually found this exact same print and everything. So I'll link them down below for you guys as well as some other color options you can choose from and whatever color you get in this sweater or if you get a couple different colors any plaid blanket scarf like this will go there's always so many different colors in the plaids and I think that it just turns out to be such a cute little fall outfit with a hat or a beanie or any kind of hair accessory some boots hunter boots and this kind of outfit I feel like is also perfect for Thanksgiving and the holiday season I'm always trying to find outfits that one look cute but are still very very comfortable because because you know Thanksgiving, you're doing a lot of eating, so you want something comfy and not tight, and this would be the perfect outfit for that. So had to share that as a fun little outfit idea to keep in mind. This little top, I absolutely love. It just looks like me. It's kind of feminine, which is definitely my style, and I think it's just so darling. I love all of this detailing, and I love too that it is longer in the back. I think that just makes it pretty and flattering, and I love the poofy sleeves too, super cute, and this cream color, I think will be really great for the fall season. I love pairing cream or white with some cognac brown boots or over the knee boots, but you could also pair it with some black shoes or like the stone taupe colored booties. So just very versatile and definitely something you could dress up or down. Next up is this Darling matching set. I think that this is so stinking cute. So it comes with the skirt, which I love the two tiers. It's got the ruffle detail and then the matching top, which the sleeves are super cute too. They're just kind of billowy and they've got the ruffle detail at the wrist. And I think the color is perfect for fall too. It's kind of just like that salmon-y burnt orange color and it's got the little white dots all over it. Just again, very feminine, which is definitely my style. And I love that you can mix and match the top and the bottom too. So you could pair the top just with some jeans if you want to. And I love that it is long sleeve, so it's perfect to take into the fall season. And then this kind of skirt, I love pairing just with like a basic white tee. You can tuck it in, tie it in a knot right at the top of the skirt. Whatever Whatever you want to do, pair it with then like a denim jacket or you could even do just like a white long sleeve so you don't have to wear a jacket. But I also love pairing these little tiered skirts with band tees or graphic tees and then again you can tuck it in or tie it in a knot however you want to style it. Add on a denim jacket on top of that or a little utility jacket and I think it just makes for such a cute look. And then do sneakers or booties. I've just got this set on with these brown booties right now and I still think that this set would also be darling with a hat. I'll throw that on next so you guys can see how that looks but seriously just the cutest little set. Mix and match it, pair it together and it will just be something cute and different for the fall season and it's very comfortable too. And then here's what the set looks like with my hat on and then I've still got it on just with the booties. You could also do over the knee boots with this skirt and set too but I feel like adding on the hat just kind of gives it that western feel for the fall kind of that boho look that I love so super cute. I think you guys would love this set too. Next up is this cute little knit set and this is so incredibly soft and comfortable and these little knit sets have become super popular and will definitely be on trend for the fall and winter season. I love this chocolate brown color. I think it's just so pretty and rich and cozy for the fall season. Petal and Pup actually has quite a few different little knit sets and lounge sets to choose from though so you'll have to shop around on their site and pick your favorite. This one has a turtleneck up here and I could just absolutely live in this. It is beyond comfortable. And and these, of course, are comfortable for lounging around in at home. I've got mine on just with these white furry slippers that Petal and Pup does. They do these in a couple different colors. So this is just the perfect little outfit for me working from home. I can just put this on for the day and I'm comfortable but still cute and put together for the day. And then just as your outfit for the day, these sets are really cute paired with like those slip-on mules like the Gucci ones or the look-alike. Sam Edelman usually does some really great look-alike. Some of them even have the fur on the heel area. 
area. Those are so cute paired with little sweater and knit sets like this. I've seen some outfit inspiration pictures like on Instagram and Pinterest. So I can't wait to style this set with shoes like that for the season. You could also do some sneakers to add on like a moto jacket or a denim jacket if you want to. But I think that this chocolate color turned out so pretty. And again, they have lots of different ones to choose from. All right, so that is it for my Petal and Pup try on haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you did. And everything is linked right down below in the description box as well as sizing info for each item that I tried on and my discount code is 20 Rachel that'll get you 20% off your purchase through the end of September but hopefully that gave you guys a little fall outfit inspiration you'll have to let me know which look or which item was your favorite leave a comment down below and thank you so much for watching I'll talk to you guys next time bye